All right, welcome back to another video, everyone. So I've got another amazing location for you here today. So we've got an abandoned house. It's about to be demolished. The dem demolition fencing is already up. And this one doesn't have a lot of time left. Now, this is really cool. It's built in 1971. It has a lot of the original features, but it also has a lot of updates as well. So it's a bit of a mixture. It's like maybe 50-50 split, something like that. But I think you guys are really gonna like this one because the original features that are left over are absolutely incredible. Can't wait to show you everything there is to see here. And let's check out the static space. get this one started. As I mentioned in the intro, this is a great little 70s house. Well, here you've got your new tone intercom. Those are so common back in the day. Very cool stuff. Yeah, so, I mean, this place isn't completely original, but there are a lot of aspects to it that are, and also a lot that aren't. Oh, this must have been the master because we've got the ensuite here. Oh, can't go through there. Okay. But yeah, here's the bathroom. Oh, that's why. <laughs> oh, well, endo doors warped. Yeah, these aren't original doors. These are upgraded hollow core doors, unfortunately. But look at this tile work. <clears throat> Love that. And the bidet, you gotta have the bidet. I've never actually used one of these. I get the feeling I wouldn't like it. <laughs> That's just my impression. Anyway, let me know down in the comments if you guys have ever used a bidet. If you have, did you like it? Did you not like it? I'd be really interested to hear your opinion on that. Yeah, so this is all original. Like, Check out this countertop. That's pretty cool. You don't often see an unused countertop like this in a bathroom. So maybe it's for like diaper changing or something. Who knows? Putting your make, no, there's no, oh, there probably was a mirror there, right? So it's probably for putting your makeup on. Big closet. That countertop looks original. Obviously those sinks aren't. I don't know, this doesn't, yeah, it's original. It doesn't look original from the outside. It's. It looks as though they put on a, a new facing onto the cupboard, so that's interesting. That towel works original, that is great. Yeah, I'm liking that. And this tub, it's very shallow, but that color. Boy, these types of houses are so cool. Oh, and I didn't mention the, uh, the nice hardwood floor in this room. And then you got your tile floor here. Now, is this hardwood? I think this might be. It doesn't really look like laminate. There's your cupboard. Ugly modern light fixture. You've got this whole huge deck out here. This thing's massive. 
And this is a really big home. I don't know if I'd really call it a mansion, but it almost is. Maybe it'll fit into the playlist of not quite a mansion or almost a mansion, whatever I called it. So got some kids artwork here. A.Y. Jackson, eh? that that wood wall back there pedestal sink and those uh, little track lights there I wonder what's over there is it like a oh it's a closet kind of weird how the wall doesn't continue all the way up top strange oh look at this doorbell it's more modern but it's still kind of cool And here's your front door. This is great. Love this front door. Nice chandelier there. And the light sconce. These are just your cupboards, I think. Uh, I know. Yeah, there's a few boxes there for moving. Oh, banana boxes. Somebody likes to use those for moving. They mentioned in the comments in one of my earlier videos. Yeah, it's a nice door. Look at that, eh? So nice. Great windows. Oh, I absolutely love these windows. So cool. It lets in the light without Allowing people to really see what's going on, right? Okay. Holy. So we've got porch out here. Front porch. Very, um, boy, what a nice house. Can you imagine living here? Like especially when it was like still in really good condition, right? I do not like these pillars at all. These must have been an addition. Like a renovation or whatever. These are pretty terrible. I don't know. Kind of reminds me of the McMansions that are replacing these places with the, uh, the pillars, right? I guess but this kitchen this is incredible really really nice really liking this island counter here I don't like the countertop so much this was obviously newer added more recently I don't like the stone countertops. You gotta be careful when you put things down on them and they require more maintenance, that sort of thing. Not a fan. But look, it adds so much covered space. Wow, that's incredible. I don't think there's anything in these cupboards. But yeah, these are the original cupboards. Again, they may have, they didn't do much to them. Maybe change the, uh, the hardware. But pretty much original. Oh my gosh. Wow, that is a beautiful oven. The Moffat, of course. Got the clock. Oh, and that's clean too. Wow. 
they took good care of this thing. No doubt that it worked. And your warming drawer underneath. Wow. This is, uh, oh, I love these ovens, I really do. This is all modern. No surprise. And of course this is as well, and that's pretty ugly too. I don't like that at all. <laughs> it's, it's bad. Nothing in the fridge. Nothing in the freezer. Okay, they're stinky though. So I think this one's been sitting for at least a, a little while. What a kitchen though, eh? Okay, what do we got here? Dining room, I would imagine. Oh, here's the main, uh, your main new tone. I wonder if the radio works. Nope. That's cool though. And then you've got, I mean, this whole house has porches. There's like porches all around it pretty much, it seems. Look at that. This one's all been screened in, so now it's more of a sunroom. But can you imagine? It'd be such a nice place to relax when it's warm out, when the sun's shining, even on a colder day. Here's the brickwork. I hate these bricks. They just look like cheap. Like the manufacturers were like too lazy to, you know, get a nice smooth flat surface. Yeah, I really don't like those at all. <laughs> Color's not bad though. But look at this thing. You've got your grill here. That is incredible. I've never even seen one of these before. Not like this, anyway. Yeah. Wow. What a, a nice grill. Very cool. Oh, love those handles. So these are original sliding doors. From 71. And here's your, I don't know, your second dining room. <laughs> I don't know, maybe this is the dining room and this was the extension of the kitchen for your kitchen table. I always wonder in these houses, right? Because they're, they're so big, they have rooms that exceed the normal amount of rooms. So we did all down there. Let's head down this way. So here we've got staircase. That's really nice like those balusters and of course the um, really nice wood railing, eh? Wow, they don't make things like this anymore. Okay, down into the basement. All right, storage here, I guess. Oh, even the closet is tiled. I have never seen that before. Wow. See, I knew there was a reason I was looking in the closets. You just never know, right? Nothing in there. But look at this tile work. That's some nice stuff. Love that. <laughs> and the edging there. This has obviously been modernized, this bathroom, modern tile. But the walls are all original by the looks of things. Pedestal sink. Here's your shower. Yeah, this is original. I like that little cutout there. That, that may have been added later, maybe. I'm not sure. 
Okay, well this is cool. Check out this countertop. That's sort of like burnt yellow color. And this is all completely original. They haven't even painted it or touched the uh, fixtures or anything. That's nice. Oh, a bit of a step up there I wasn't expecting. Another fridge. Oh, this one's an Eaton Viking. That's old school. That's like 80s too, I think. It looks more modern than that though. But Eaton Viking haven't been making fridges in quite a while, I think. Oh my gosh. Look at this. We got food here. What's the date? 2014, 2016, 2020. Oh geez, so this sauce is super expired, fish sauce. We've got chocolate, guys. Arrow chocolate. Oh, and lint chocolate, sea salt chocolate. Who puts their chocolate in the fridge? I hate cold chocolate. Let me know down in the comments. Do you put your chocolate in the fridge? Strawberry syrup. I was not expecting anything to be in there. Oh, geez. Look at all the chocolate in here. These chocolate bars aren't cheap either. I don't know what I'm having for lunch. <laughs> yeah, right. Lisa's wedding cake. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? What? Why would you leave that? I know I shouldn't open this, but. Okay, I'm not opening that, but wow. Why would you save your wedding cake and then not? I'm curious, but no. I mean, we've all seen cake, right? So forget that. <laughs> that is cool though. June 2nd, 2018. So that's old. That's five-year-old cake right there, guys. Put that back in the freezer where it belongs. No idea what, this looks like cheese. Oh yeah, that's moldy. That's gross. Okay, that's like gotta be the coolest find. Lisa's wedding cake. <laughs> okay, we got the laundry room here. Nice tubs. This one's pretty, pretty worn and dirty though. Like brand new washer dryer here. That's nuts. Dryer, washer. Okay, yeah, I mean, they're not brand new, but you know, they're, they're pretty new. I'm sure that uh, this place will be cleaned out and everything donated. I know you guys are gonna ask that sort of thing, so. It will be demolished very soon. And like I said, cleared out ahead of time. Yeah, nice kitchen. So this is what, kitchen number two? I wonder how many kitchens are gonna be in this house. Oh, that's the range hood. Well, that's cool. Count the kitchens, guys. So this is your cold storage here. Lots of bubble wrap. Aww. Aww. There we go. <laughs> Another, fr oh, coffee. That's a lot of coffee. Moffitt Slim Twin. Oh, this one, this fridge is, oh my gosh, I love that. The interior of this fridge, it's just lovely. Oh yeah. Look at this, it's for your, like your, I don't know, your juice, your condensed juice. 
something like that. That's pretty cool. Such a nice fridge though. Wow. All right, keep moving here. There's a lot to see. No, just a closet. Thought maybe it was a bathroom. Oh, garage. Right. Well, that's cool. Tile in the garage, eh? There's a window back here. What's in there? Oh, okay. We'll see that in a minute. Okay, I got more of these great windows. Love these things. Nice big two car garage. Oh, clogs. Wooden clogs. Oh, lots of storage space up there too. Oh, that's what that was, a shelf. Oh, check out this, first aid. Oh, wow, there's, holy, that is cool. Retro first aid box, I like that. A little ceiling in here. So what do we got? More cold storage. Okay. Yeah, your furnace room. Oh, Jesus. HVAC. Oh, jeez. Yeah, that's an old school furnace too. That's really old. Um, oh, wow, we still got so much more to go. Whoopsie. Yeah, we still got a lot to go, guys. A lot more to see. Try and speed things up a bit here. This looks more modern. This place is huge. Toiletries and such. Oh, what's, oh, look at this ceiling. Oh, that's coming down. Yeah, there's some decay in here. Finally, some furniture though. Well, that's all right. Oh yes, look at this fireplace. Oh, they had to put an insert in, eh? What a shame, hate to see that. Still really cool though. What a cool fireplace. Um, yeah, so this must've been in a separate apartment here, like Those are kind of cool. I mean, everything, well, almost everything's modern here. Glass table, free. Oh, I see. Boy, no wonder it's free. They didn't want to move it. So there's probably a glass table top in here, right? That's super heavy, but check this out. That is cool. <laughs> This brick arch. Again, not a fan of these types of bricks, but this I can appreciate. So this is kitchen number three. Keeping count? I hope so. But yeah, I can see, wow, this would be such a, a fun kitchen to use. So this was probably, probably originally a bar. Nice wet bar. This would have been amazing, right? can only imagine cleaning supplies I suspect there'll be some stuff left over here yeah dishes and stuff that's an old oven yeah so formerly a wet bar that they converted into a kitchen so they could uh, rent out an apartment 
Very cool stuff. Another fridge. This one's open already. Oh, that's weird. Oh, that's to keep it from closing all the way, right? Well, that's pretty smart. Ooh. Yeah, this is an older fridge too, Viking. Looks, looks 90s, maybe early 2000s, possibly. This is just gonna be a closet, right? Yeah. Boy, this place is so much bigger than I expected. Bunk beds. All right, so there's one more area that we haven't seen yet. And it's like a separate building, but yet like the same building kind of. Nice staircase, really like that. So going out here, again, some nice windows, nice door here. Oh, check out that, eh? That's cool. Oh, you don't paint a screen door. That's weird. Oh yeah, so they got the outdoor pool here. That's cool. Very, very cool. I don't know if this is supposed to be like the pool house or what, but oh my gosh. Wow. Oh, geez. Yeah, so this is a really cool room, really cool add-on or whatever you want to call it. Love the wood. Here you've got, oh, another kitchen. This is kitchen number four, guys. Kitchen number four. That is crazy. Even this is nice tile work, eh? That's a pretty modern stove. Okay, fridge here. Oh, bathroom. Yeah, original tiles. Most of this one's original. Very impressive. Oh, that's cool too. Definitely like that. Yeah, love all the wood in here. Absolutely amazing. Nice glass doors there with the individual panes of wood. And then of course you got this staircase here. which doesn't really go anywhere. Nope, nowhere. Huh. Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh my gosh, this place never ends. Holy, my gosh. Is that scale? Oh boy, 
I, I can't believe it. This place is just massive. Huge. Oh, it's another garage. Wow. A lot of junk in here. Pretty cool stuff though. Yep, I like it. All right, thanks a lot for watching everyone. Really hope you enjoyed this location. Love these mid-century homes, right? They're, they're always so cool. Even when they're partially updated, they're still really interesting. When they have some of the original decor, the original architecture, always makes for a fun explore. Hope you guys enjoy them as much as I do. If you do, give it a like, throw a comment down below if you have anything to say. I know you have something to say because I asked a few questions throughout this video. So throw a comment down below, share it. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you all at the next. Static space.